For the next 21 days, I'm going to replace my laptop with this phone and see if I die. I tried doing an actual paid client video editing work on it, backup footages and all admin work. But whilst I wait for my Uperfect lap dock, which is like a monitor specifically made for Dex, I figured out a way to do the same thing on my iPad. And wife's, wife's making art. <laughs> that's, that's what she does now. Hey boys. Yeah. Yeah. Can I have a picture? See bro. HDMI in, then plug this HDMI in, then plug this guy in, and then I can use the iPad. Look at me having the time of my life. And look how boring my wife's setup is. It's called simple. This is, this is life. We need to beat 12,000 likes and 1,000 comments on this video, and my wife will use the S24 Ultra. Deal? Okay. I'll do that. She said she'll do it. I had a bunch of photos that needed to be edited. And instead of using Dex, this S Pen, Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, and this flat screen was amazing. It totally smashed out the raw 42 megapixel photos. Then I just plugged it back into Dex mode and uploaded it to Google Photos for the group to see. And that was a seamless experience. One thing about Samsung, whether you love them or hate them, is that they have courage to try just about anything that sounds cool on paper. This is probably how the DEX mode was invented behind the scenes. Your turn, Mr. King. You plug your phone into the monitor and it turns into a desktop experience. You can run Photoshop and After Effects natively. Our users are going to love this. Nobody is going to buy the iPad Pros or the MacBook Pros if you release this feature. You're fired. Watch this. You plug your Samsung phone into a monitor for a desktop experience. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. I call this Dex. Yeah, yeah, wow. Yeah, this young man is Yeah, I'm going to Yeah, wow. Yeah. Oh. Samsung Dex. Samsung Dex. Ah, good. Oh, good. I am a novice when it comes to not only Samsung phones, but when it comes to Dex and its capabilities. And instead of me looking it up and watching 50 videos, I found this dude. YouTube channel is called Tech With Benefits. And um, yeah, I asked him all the questions I wanted to ask Google, and he should know because he's been using Dex his whole life. Uh, anyway, thanks so much, bro, for jumping on our channel. That's all right. What is the simplest cable setup for Dex mobile? My go-to, and this never leaves my bag, is a USB-C to HDMI adapter. That's really simple, but the simplest one is C to C. Has Dex ever saved your life? Dex is such a good solution for traveling because if you have a TV in your hotel room, you've got a desktop set up. Just like, oh, I've got Dex. It's knowing that you have Dex, I think that saves it, not necessarily always needing to use it, but knowing it's there is a, is a good peace of mind. After having a one hour chat with Daniel, I've come to understand the capabilities and limitations of DEX. So my next test was video editing on DEX. Now, if this works, I may as well just chuck my MacBook Pro in the bin. <gasps> okay, so I just finished filming something and I'm gonna edit the whole thing on this device. The client has zero idea. They think I'm gonna use some crazy supercomputer. Nah, man, I'm gonna just use my phone in my pocket. So I am in an awesome part of Sydney called Kiribili. I think it's a expensive ass kind of place. Isn't it crazy to think that my career is on this little card? Like if I was to just th throw this over there, that's it, my career is gone. I found this incredible cafe literally above the water. Plugged my SD card in and imported my 4K video files. Whether this actually works or not is besides the point. The fact that I could even try on my phone is just pure gangster. How cool is Australia? Look at that. That's 
this nuts, bro. We have a slight issue with using the DEX mode for video editing. Now, when it comes to editing the MP4 files that come from this camera, absolutely fine. But when it comes from editing the cinema camera, my FX6, the LumaFusion app that I'm using to edit doesn't take MXF files. My Intel MacBook Pro would have shat its ass, but this phone managed to cut through it like butter. Phone didn't get hot. The awesome thing about this lap dock that I'm using is that it actually comes with a 10,000 milliamp hour battery. So it powers itself and it charges your phone, which is cool. So for the next 14 days, I walked around like a gangster with an actual computer in my pocket. Every Monday, I create a custom icon packs. And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna see if Dex is capable using Figma. I'm happy to announce that I have created the icon pack for Android. But yeah, I'll leave the link in the description. Go and check it out. Thanks for the support guys, it means so much. I grabbed the best coffee in Strathfield. I'll give it a 9.7 out of a 10. This is crazy. Then headed over to Starbucks for better ambience and also to test their coffee. One out of 10. What you're looking at right now is Samsung DeX and Figma, which is totally working for my icon designs. The fact that you can do Figma on this phone is absolutely bananas. All right, so I've been using DeX for about 14 days now, exclusively as my main computer. Anyone that uses DeX for the first time in their life is like, whoa, this is sick, because it is. But when you start using it, you start to see the limitations and whatnot. There are two types of people that DeX could be useful for. The niche people, number one, is people that have an awesome desktop setup, but no laptop. I used to be one of those people. I didn't have a laptop for about a year. DeX would have been great. The second type of people is people like, kind of like me, where you've got a laptop, fat ass laptop, like my 16 inch M1 Max MacBook Pro, and you want to go out or you want to go on a holiday and you're not going to do heavy duty work. If you've got a phone like this, just bring this, bring a little monitor, you're good to go. Now, I edited as much as I could on DeX, I'm using LumaFusion, but I could not finish the edit because it was so difficult working with a two camera kind of timeline. I, I just went, you know what, I can't, I can't do this. I'm gonna wait till this test is over and I'm just gonna edit it on my MacBook. Can this DeX thing actually replace your laptop? No. And yes, at the same time. For me, no, because I need to edit videos, I need After Effects, I need animations, I need things that this phone is not capable of yet. It has the power to do it, just doesn't have the software support to do it. But this thing kills admin work. Notion stuff to do, easy. Emails, easy. Google Sheets, Excel, easy. Can you edit Wix website on this? Yes. Can you do Figma? Yes. Would I rather have it than not have it? Absolutely. And so now I'm torn because if you don't know, this wasn't meant to replace my Android phone of choice, which was the Pixel 8. Give me a second. This was the phone that this replaced. I'm absolutely torn. You know what's crazy? This is not a review of the S24 Ultra. This was a review of DeX, okay? I might compare it with my other daily driver, the iPhone 13 mini, which is kind of like the polar opposite of what this is. So I'll do a review and come up with a verdict of which one I would prefer. If you had a gun to my head, what would I choose? Something crazy happened after I was done with this video, okay? I'm using my laptop again. One of my clients were like, can you send us the 800 gigabytes worth of footage? And because my internet's crap here in Australia, it's gonna take me a whole week to upload. Which means my laptop is stuck at home uploading that stupid footage for the client, which means I'm forced to use DeX again. Not for a video sake, not me doing an experiment. And so I was in the car the other day, this was like yesterday. Kids were sleeping and Joy woke up and she's like, Dad, I want to play games until Mia wakes up. But I forgot the iPad. And then I realized I can connect this thing wirelessly to my U-Perfect monitor, which I had. So what I did was I wirelessly connected it to Dex to my monitor, writing out scripts, whilst Joy was playing games on this in the back seat. 
That is mind blowing. I didn't even know you could do that. But that's crazy. So you can use this as a phone while someone else is using it as DeX. And now this is why you need 50 million gigs of RAM. That's how much RAM this has. 50 million gigs. <laughs> that's, that's, that's not good. That's $7,000 in between four fingers. Holy crap. One, two, three.